The Slytherin Common Room, Hogwarts Legacy, every explorable location, confirmed so far. The Slytherin Common Room was a common room for Slytherin House, located in Slytherin Dungeon. In general, it sported several shades of green and the mantle was adorned with a portrait of a serpent, all associated with the house. There was a door on the right side of the entrance hall, if coming down the marble staircase facing the front doors of the castle, that was most frequently used by Slytherin students to get to their common room. Behind the door was a set of stone steps which descended deep into the dungeons. Note that this door was different from the entrance to the narrow staircase that led down to Snape's office. The entrance to the common room was located behind a bare stretch of stone wall in the dungeons of Hogwarts Castle. A password was required to enter it, whereupon a passage was revealed leading to the common room. The Slytherin common room was a long, low underground room with rough stone walls and ceiling, from which round, greenish lamps were hanging on chains. A fire was crackling under an elaborately carved mantelpiece ahead of them, and several Slytherins were silhouetted around it in carved chairs. The common room was a dungeon-like room with greenish lamps and chairs. This dungeon extended partway under the lake, giving the light in the room a green tinge. The common room had lots of low-backed black and dark green button-tufted, leather sofas, skulls, and dark wood cupboards. One of the wooden tables had a wizard's chest set on it. It was decorated with tapestries featuring the adventures of famous medieval Slytherins. It is quite a grand atmosphere, but also quite a cold one. It was decorated with pumpkins for Halloween at least once in the 1980s. The password to the common room changed every fortnight, and it was posted on the notice board. Slytherin students were warned never to bring students from other houses into the common room or to reveal the password. Supposedly, no outsider had entered the common room for more than seven centuries until Harry and Ron entered Slytherin common room in 1992. As of 2016, a portrait of Horace Slughorn had a place in the common room due to his bravery at the Battle of Hogwarts. According to Nicholas de Mimsey Porpington, the Bloody Baron had scared many a young Slytherin student in the Slytherin common room. During the 1988-1989 school year, Marilla Snide and Jacob's sibling spoke to the Bloody Baron in the Slytherin common room to ask him for information on locating Peeves. He refused to part with any information with them and was not much help. On December 25, 1992, in Harry Potter's second year, he and Ron Weasley went into the Slytherin common room, disguised as Vincent Crabbe and Gregory Goyle, with the aid of Polyjuice Potion, to attempt to discover the identity of the heir of Slytherin. The entry password was pure blood when Draco Malfoy let them in. The Polyjuice potions wearing off prompted Harry and Ron to leave after staying nearly an hour, still not finding out the identity of the heir of Slytherin, but they did learn that Malfoy was not the heir, as they originally thought. 